Well, good Tuesday afternoon, friends. Mark Holmes here, and as always, I want to say thank you all for watching, commenting, subscribing, and being part of the Joe Boo Sports Report. Without you guys, as well as you ladies, you know that this literally does not work. Wow. Okay, so, you know, the sports entertainment world, kind of like wrestling, because that's what it's really turned into. It's not really sports news. It's really sports entertainment. When we're talking about the talking shows like Undisputed and First Take. Yesterday, we had Stephen A. Smith saying that he has it from good authority from his sources that Stefan Diggs wants out of Buffalo. Stefan says, man, you're whack. But now we have Michael Irving joining, as Skip Bayless says, the new dream team, which will be having him as well as Keyshawn Johnson. We'll have a new Little Wayne song as an intro. And uh, we'll have, um, I forgot who the female is from ESPN. Um, boy, I'm having a brain fart. But Michael Irvin is definitely happy about getting back to work. And questions still remain on is he still suspended by the nfl network because we're going on six months right now and he's still listed as part of the uh, game day four so there is no clarification on anything as far as that goes but this is a heartwarming piece right here let me show you guys michael irvin he has actually posted this Baby, huh? Hi, you got a picture? Huh? Hi, Sarah. Oh, it's a Barbie. See, my little baby has on Barbie, don't you? What'd you get the Barbie for? I know. Huh? Oh, she's the cutest baby in the world. I'm not here so much. Oh. He taught you slow. I know, Papa. Hmm. Papa taught you slow. Oh, get yeah. it, baby. <laughs> Say hi. 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 <laughs> Hello. He posted that with a tweet about an hour ago. Whatever life throws at you, the little ones will make it all better. Thanks, everyone, for the support and Godspeed. So that's where we are with Michael Irvin. He is going to be joining starting Monday, August 28th. Um, Skip Bayless. I'm not sure. I mean, I'm happy. I'm very, very happy that Michael Irving is getting back to work. Um, I don't know. This is this is on my, my own personal question. I'm not an attorney or anything like that. But as far as his case goes, his lawsuit where he is suing, I actually believe it would have been better if he was still unemployed because you can go through and say hey since that incident I, i've been suspended by the nfl network i've been suspended by espn you know i'm doing ads for an rv company and autograph signings i am not in the spotlight like i was everything changed for me after that incident and that's where you go through and say hey yeah here we go he can't get back to his life he can't do that earning potential but when you get hired by Fox Sports doing basically the same thing you were doing with ESPN, then they kind of look and say, it really didn't have an effect on you. At least that's my take. And again, I'm not an attorney. I don't know. Um, it will be interesting since Michael Irving is a Cowboy fan with Skip Bayless, who is supposedly a Cowboy fan. I'm not sure where the tension comes in because Keyshawn Johnson is a little kinder and gentler towards the Cowboys than most of the talking heads. So maybe it's going to be a new script for Skip Bayless and a change in attitude. Maybe Skip Bayless is going to become the anti-Dallas Cowboy. We know he's already the anti-Dak Prescott guy. It's, I guess they're trying to put a little air of mystery to try and get a boost uh, for its re-air. Hmm. We'll have to wait and see. But I'm happy for Michael Irvin that uh, he will be back in the spotlight because he is, whether you're a Cowboy fan or not, he is a very, very entertaining, knowledgeable football player slash host and i will look forward to actually seeing him again and uh we still 
don't have any clarification on when the case will actually be heard. Um, it should have actually had a date set for it, but there's been no news on the case. For all we know, maybe he'll get settled out of court and he'll just get back to his life. I'm Mark Holmes, and well, I appreciate you guys, and I'll see you soon.